students of Bristol Free School, I come to you today with some serious news. We have heard reports from multiple news sites and the Department of Education that there's a new virus taking hold in the UK. The virus seems to be presenting itself with some bizarre symptoms, starting with a fever, quickly changing to a skip to a changing your skin colour to go to a weird green. There seems to be unconfirmed cases beyond this, but I will come back to you with a bit more later. What I need from you, Year 7 and 8, is to use all your skills to help this plague. I know you are all amazing scientists, enthusiastic and engineers, and incredible mathematicians. Exactly the kind of people that the virologists need to help with. The Department of Education has asked us to map the spread of the disease, what kind of disease we are working with, and can we detect it in humans, and are vaccines an option? BFS, we will need to use all our skills, knowledge and capabilities to fight this virus. You could be the heroes. We need you. reason what we're going to do. We might have to sort of quarantine the science department. Okay, I'll let them know. BFS, this is what you need to know. We have a new disease sweeping the population. Things are deteriorating across the nation. We have been, we have a rapid spread and we need, and we now need you to study the disease. We need to understand how it affects the body. We have had numerous reports of fever, headaches, and green tinge in the skin, but a new symptom appears to be hankering for blood. We need you, year seven and eight, to investigate and research the virus. We need you to understand how the virus spreads from person to person. It's airborne. Is it through skin contact? We also need you to, to learn how the virus works and what this virus looks like. We need you to be modelling out for the national scientists. Honestly, we need you. Get on with it, guys. Uh, mathematicians, mathematicians, hi, hi. Um, it's got some important news. The virus is spreading much faster than we anticipated. Bristol has been breached. Here's the footage from the Cabot Circus an hour ago. There are the scenes. Our next steps is we need to contain the virus and fence them off. We cannot let this get into BS10. We need to understand how fast this is spreading and build a quarantine parameter to keep us all safe. We can't, we're relying on all our top mathematicians in year seven and eight to assist the national effort. I'm sorry to call upon you again. I hope to be back with you with the better news. Stay safe, BFS. Once again, the news is grim. I have new reports of the center, from the Centre of Disease Control and the NHS. 
People are being consumed by this virus and seeming to feast on human flesh. The, the green tinge in the skin, it's a definite symptom, along with the fever and the nausea. These symptoms are incredibly unpleasant. However, there may be hope. Hope with a vaccine. As, as we know, vaccines need to be trialled before our use in humans. How do, we do, how do we do this in time? How do we ask people to volunteer? Will anyone volunteer? I've had word from the Joint Council on Vaccinations and Immunisations that we're able to vaccine people who are willing. Um, this is a real dilemma. Is it, it's now whether or not we determine whether we should push ahead with the effort, given the risks, or should the population be forced to be vaccinated to protect us all? You need to decide. Work in your groups and consider the ethics of this. I've just been bitten by Dr. Martin. Oh, really? Really? Yes. Don't, don't worry about it. Honestly, go back to your office. Don't worry about it. Things are getting worse, year, year seven and eight. We need you as engineers to design some wearable technology that you can detect and see if you've been infected. It should be light, it needs to be portable, you can wear it quickly and then you'll be able to escape. Get working, top engineers. Best of luck, we're counting on you. seven and eight, I hope you're okay and still in communication. It's been a perilous day and we've come across quite a few un unusual green walking people. Um, really quite concerned but this is why we've got to push together. It's the final push BFS. We've got to get over this, this challenge. So this is what we've got to do year seven and eight. One of our members of staff has been secretly working on a safe vaccine that can protect us all, but they have been, have been cornered by the zombies. You must now nominate four of your brightest, boldest and best to complete the final challenge. You will need one person, each suited to the following four categories. One person for physical, one for mental, one for skill and one for mystery. Who has, it, what it, who has what it takes? What tutor group will be our heroes? When you have chosen your representatives, make your way to the mugger where the next hurdle awaits. For the last time, BSS, good luck!